It's definitely a hidden gem. Uncured turkey bacon, like Canadian style bacon. A little bit shorter. See coming through? Hey you guys! Welcome back to another vloggy vlog. Hey you guys, today is Monday morning, y'all. It is bright and early. It is 9.15. Um, AM my first appointment today comes at 9 y'all let me open up let me open up a couple of these blinds get us some sunlight in here okay period all right y'all yeah so today is Monday morning y'all it is Halloween week so Halloween is this Sunday I believe yeah it's this Sunday and I am booked this week well I'm not all the way booked I do have a few openings left on my website for this week so, yeah, but so far, like, my Monday, my Thursday, I think my Friday is booked. I have a couple openings Saturday, and I opened up Wednesday because it is a holiday week, y'all, and it's going to be busy, so I might as well open up my book to make more money, especially since I haven't just been booked this whole month like that, like I normally am. So, yeah, anyways, y'all, today is Monday. I am making me some breakfast while I about to, you know, wash my face and stuff. I literally just got up. Actually, y'all. I didn't just get up. I've been up for like an hour. Um, I was editing a video this morning. So I edited one last night, uploaded it um, on my blonde uh, highlighted look. And then um, I'm editing a vlog right now. So I have another video coming out for you guys. And then this will be after that one, I think. Yeah. So anyways, today is Monday, y'all. October the... 25th so right now y'all i'm boiling me some eggs making me a little breakfast something light so i can eat today and then y'all i had tried this um connect uncured turkey bacon like canadian style bacon y'all it is really good so if you like turkey bacon or if you're trying to cut out pork like me um try this y'all it's at heb and it's uncured turkey bacon y'all it tastes just like um ham and it has that same like um texture so i'm about to put my breakfast in the oven so that I can eat before my client here. But yeah, y'all got a pretty um, busy week this week um, with the appointments and then really just getting myself also ready for um, Halloween, which I don't even know what I'm doing or if I'm doing anything yet, but um, I do need to get myself, like my nails haven't been done or nothing. I've been trying to let my nails um heal a little bit because that last set y'all I have snatched them off not even gonna lie I didn't I didn't do it so far because I hate doing so far it's so time consuming so anyway so yeah so I'm about to get myself ready y'all for this week we're gonna do a week at work with me or just a week with me in general most of it's gonna be just working this week taking clients and stuff like that um I know y'all like those kind of vlogs when I'm taking nail for me so yeah let me get myself ready and then I will be back y'all once I'm actually comb my hair and put on my work clothes for today so your girl is dressed i just got on like a little bodysuit with my slides i'm ashy it don't matter um and i just clip my hair up y'all so this is my work attire for today period it's giving comfortable and cute and this bodysuit is giving body okay period so my client is outside already, so I didn't get to clean up my desk like I wanted to. So I'ma just Lysol everything down, and we are gonna call it a day. Uh, now my head, my house smells like boiled eggs, y'all. Like eggs, you know, when you crack the boiled eggs, but got my breakfast, so. Ooh. Mm. Um. Yeah, y'all about to knock this first appointment out. She got a hand scrub with her appointment, so I have to grab that. And I got goodie, oh, let me show this thing. I got goodie bags and um, goodie bags for my clients inside. It has like a sticker and a business card. Or they can just grab some from this candy bucket for this week because it's Halloween week. So I thought that was super cute, y'all. So tap in, get some incentives, something to make your clients want to come, y'all. But yeah, about to knock this appointment out.
just finished my second appointment so today is Monday y'all and um it's my short day so I don't work all the way until um like my normal days I work until 8 30 um sometimes nine but on Mondays I work until five so Mondays are my short so I'm off on Sundays I work Mondays but they're my short days and then Wednesday is my other off day so yeah that's kind of how I operate my week and everything else I work until 9 p.m. Um, but I'm hungry, y'all. I need a snack. That um that little breakfast then we're off, y'all. It is 1 12:40. And um my next appointment comes at 1 o'clock. I'm gonna take Layla ass to walk, y'all. Keep on walking to the door. You wanna go outside? Is that what it is? She has a pad, pee pad, y'all, but she just be determined not to use that pad. But yeah, y'all, um, I'm about to do that before my next appointment comes. I'll probably just wait to eat until after she comes. Let me walk Layla real quick, cause she getting on my freaking nerves, acting like she can't pee on her pad, and then I will be back to finish my last client for the day. From getting me something to eat I ran to the taco truck because I wasn't trying to cook me no lunch <sighs> yeah y'all I wasn't trying to cook me no lunch I'm cooking me some dinner tonight and I don't really know what I'm gonna cook just yet but I went to the taco truck y'all and these tacos I got are fire so freaking good if you from Houston if you know you know if you don't you don't I'm about to eat though and watch me a little um 
VH1, y'all, because I low-key forgot this was coming on. I be having to watch it on my computer because... Y'all know, bitch ain't got cable. I just got Hulu, Netflix, and all the other stuff. I ain't really got nothing to watch this on. But I do be watching um, Love and Hip Hop. Any reality TV on VH1, Love and Hip Hop, Black Ink. Um, I don't watch... Uh, I, I like Basketball Wives. They've been kind of slacking on the seasons. Um, and I don't watch Real Housewives of Atlanta. I probably should because that's what everybody be watching. So I, but I'm going to take a little chill. I just got off from doing nails. I just want to eat and relax a little bit. Before I go to the next task. So we're about to do that y'all. Hey you guys. What's up? Today is Tuesday you guys. Why do my phone keep doing it? Alright. Hey you guys. Today is Tuesday. And yeah y'all. I don't have any nail appointments a day. Today. A day. I don't have any nail appointments today y'all. Which is kind of surprising because... I really am booked this week, but I'm booked more towards Thursday, Friday, Saturday, which is the last three days um, before Halloween. Everybody want to get their nails done fresh, I guess, or whatever. So, yeah, since I don't have any appointments today, y'all, I do have a new business venture that I'm trying to tap into. So, like, across the board, y'all, it's been really slow. For since that has happened, y'all, I am picking up a new business venture, and I'm doing, like, I'm trying to start doing hair, y'all. And I feel like I do my own hair and stuff, and I still have stuff to learn, obviously. But, like, I'm not, I'm never going to know, y'all, until I actually start doing it. And I feel like I, I took this hair class, y'all, way back, like, three months ago. And I've been so nervous to, like, try and do people's hair. But people be like, people been trusting me to, like, do their hair, y'all. So, I have my first client today. I haven't done nothing today. Really got up, cleaned up. I'm doing laundry and stuff. Today is Thursday, you guys. Um, yeah. Um, today is Thursday, y'all, and I'm up. I have appointments today at 11, and it's like 10.40. I mean, not 11. I have appointments at 12, and it's 10.40, and I need to run to Hobby Lobby real quick because today, the girl's nails that I'm doing, she's getting like an abstract kind of set with the lines and hearts and shit. So, um, I want to try this set with acrylic paint. If you've ever seen anybody using acrylic paint, y'all, or people doing line work, sometimes they use acrylic paint because um, it pops more, like the color is more like vibrant. And if you use gel, um, sometimes when you do like one layer of gel, it doesn't pop as much as it needs to. So sometimes you have to go back and do it too. And when you're doing line work, you don't want to be drawing that shit twice. You already have enough trouble drawing that shit once. So yeah, y'all, I'm about to go ahead and do that. I'm dressed. This is my outfit for the day, y'all. My little outfit got some tights on with a little crop. It's a little chilly outside over here in Houston from what I've seen on um, Instagram. So I threw a little long sleeve on for y'all. I don't know if I should put some tennis shoes on. I don't know. I'm just running the Hobby Lobby. It's around the corner. Guys, uh, yeah, y'all. So just a little recap of everything that I've been doing this last couple of days. Tuesday, I didn't have no appointments, but as y'all can see, I did pick up a little trade. I'm trying to pick up a new service. We just doing hair. So I've been getting models and stuff like that, and it's been coming out good. Only thing is, like, I'm just starting, so I want to get faster at it. But um, other than that, it came out good. My client was happy and satisfied, so that's good. I've been cleaning up my apartment, kind of redoing it. So... Um, I kind of rearranged my nail area right here. I don't know if I'm going to keep it like this because now I just realized my client is back from the TV. And as y'all can see, I finally got my TV mounted. And I feel like I should have got it lifted up higher because my TV is so freaking big. I have a 65 inch y'all and it looks like it's just taking over the whole wall. But my wall is not very like high. I don't know. And then it's like. I feel like this is too heavy for the mount. It's just giving me all kind of like, uh, I should have got it higher, but 
I had this guy come do it. He was super sweet and professional, everything. And um, I was having trouble finding pieces for the mount. And it was just a lot going on when he came. And um, I might have Christina's dad lift it up for me, but just for the meantime, it's off the ground. And yeah, so the TV is up, y'all. I got some LED lights added around it. It's so cute. But I just realized, like I said, my clients are not facing my TV no more. So I put this little like stool right here. So I'm thinking that I'm going to start putting my like laptop there and like putting Netflix on my laptop and just letting them watch it like that. Um, just as long as they got something to watch. I just don't be wanting them to sit here and they'll be having nothing to watch. A lot of my clients be watching the shows and movies that I put on. So, yeah. I'm literally about to walk out the door so I can go to Hobby Lobby and grab me some breakfast because I don't want to cook breakfast today. So I'm just going to grab something or grab me like some lunch probably while I'm out because I'm booked back to back to back today. Before I get there, if you've never been to Hobby Lobby, y'all, it's a great place to shop as a nail tech too. Um, people be getting their acrylic paint from there. Sometimes girls be getting like brushes because they have acrylic paint brushes. And I'm assuming that that's what the girls be using um, to do nails with um, as well sometimes. Um, let me get over, I'm in a rush. And this thing in front of me is not. It's not. Cause why the fuck you going 22? Anyways, yeah, so if you don't shop at Hobby Lobby, people be getting a Savarsky crystals from here too. They be having them on sale a lot. So if you've never been to Hobby Lobby or if you didn't know about Hobby Lobby as a nail tech, they be having some bomb deals. But yeah, um, Hobby Lobby is definitely a hidden gem.
I'm eating a sandwich. It's gone. And my next slide is coming up. Eat my sandwich now. And my next slide should be literally walking up any minute. I'm dark because somebody had a wreck. I'm not a wreck, I'm in a black. And I had to go get her, so this, <laughs> so it's dark now, it's dark y'all. Cause I know y'all probably like, damn, it's dark, but. So let me right, just show y'all. The nail appointment was at 5.45. <laughs> right. But yeah, y'all. Y'all do, this thing right here is on one of my bras and it's hair glue. So if y'all ever see me with this bra on, it's not coming out, okay? So just ignore that. Anyways. Yeah, y'all. So it is 11 something. And I'm about to put us some dinner on. It's super late. But my last client was on her way to her appointment. And she had caught a flat, y'all. So I had to go help my girl out. And so we didn't finish her appointment until like 9 o'clock-ish. When I was supposed to be done with her at like 7 o'clock-ish. But I wasn't tripping. So if I get a flat, baby, I want somebody to come help me. So it wasn't a big deal. But um, so she, the, after we got her tire fixed, she still came and got her nails done. Or whatever. So...
right y'all so i am done doing nails for the day today is friday night so it's saturday tomorrow tomorrow i have a couple appointments too but i'm done doing nails for the day it is um seven o'clock i just got done like maybe 30 minutes ago maybe like 40 minutes ago um and i just got dressed i'm about to go get me some food but to go to this little jamaican like spot out here i don't know if, it, if it's jamaican food is it making food they got like jerk chicken and shit um so i think it is so let's go get us some food y'all so this is the end of today's work day then i'll see y'all in the morning hey you guys i'm ending my weekly vlog today today is halloween and sunday i'm off on sundays as y'all know I just finished doing nails and I ain't even posted. I don't even know if I recorded my nails from Saturday at all. But whatever, y'all. It's been a long week. I had so many appointments. There I go. I had so many appointments, y'all. And I'm just tired and I'm over it. So, yeah. Today is Sunday, y'all. And on a happy note, y'all, my girlfriend. If y'all don't know, y'all know she needs a new liver. And today, y'all, she got a call for a liver. And I just dropped off at the hospital to get the transplant, y'all. We are praying for the best thing, y'all. This one sounds like it could be for her. And like I said, they did roll her down to the operating room. So, so far, so good. I'm logging off, y'all. It's gonna be the last day of my vlog. Let me know if y'all like the content from this week, y'all. Signing out in the mix with Kim.